I'm going to keep it a buck and say that these are the stupidest designs that I've ever seen for almost all the next gen consoles. Like, I honestly thought that the brick, the Xbox Series X, I thought that was the cleanest one at first. And then the PlayStation 5 came out and I thought that one looked kind of dumb also, but then I kind of got used to it and I was like, you know what? I have a PS4 that's a dinosaur that's aging rapidly. So you know what? I'll go ahead and in a few months, I'll save some money up and I'll get myself a PS5. And now they're coming out with a new console. They're gonna sell two consoles from Xbox, from Microsoft this holiday season. One is the Xbox Series X and the other one is the Xbox S which if they weren't confusing enough, they are confusing now. And the Xbox S is just a tinier Xbox One with a giant hole in it. It looks so dumb. And next to the brick, the brick actually looks far more appealing. Like why would you spend your money? Especially, these things are not cheap. Like why would you spend your money on something that, first of all, you have the very similar design as of now. Most people that have or are going to buy Xbox, have Xbox right now. So why would you buy something that looks very, very similar to that? Like, I never understood that. And then two, this giant hole in the middle of it, I just, I just feel like it's just there for no really good reason at all because Xbox One does not really have, in my opinion, in my experience, doesn't have a cooling problem. So it looks like this is kind of what it is. I don't know if it's supposed to be a speaker, but it looks like a, some sort of cooling uh, uh, system. For the for the P xbox and this one didn't need it like the playstation 4 definitely needed it and the new design for the playstation 5 looks actually like it it definitely is geared to make sure that noise and that fan stay relatively low but again these designs all of them across the board are really kind of stupid i've again leaned more to the ps5 but as well as the PS5. It took the PS5 waifus to really push me in that direction. And that is really why I kind of started, you know, getting a little bit more comfortable with the PS5. But it looks like Xbox now has a new waifu. And here they are. Yes, this is the Xbox waifu. Of course, somebody was going to make one. And here she is. And yeah, you know, it makes me like it a little bit more. Originally, again, I liked the original brick look of the Xbox. I thought it looked interesting at least different enough but it just seems like such a huge uh you know it, i know we need so much space for it basically that's kind of why i don't want to go that direction plus i have a brand new or a semi brand new like an, a year or so old xbox one so i really don't need to upgrade the xbox or the microsoft but my playstation 4 is like six seven years old or so like i don't know around that time so it definitely needs to go but yeah the xbox has a new waifu so let me know which one are you on which team are you on and which waifu do you rep if you like anything you heard hit that sub button this is going to be sunscape signing off take care guys